Hey, 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 y'all. Welcome to the channel. For those of you that are new, welcome to Birth and Bosses with Felicia. I am Boss Lady Fee, guys. Happy, happy, miraculous Monday to each and every one of you. I hope you're having a great day, guys. I'm having a great day. Still tired a little, little bit in my body, but nevertheless, I'm having a great, great day. I wanted to show you guys a video that I did not get an opportunity to upload before Mother's Day. Um, I actually worked on this. Um, I want to say it was Friday night, I believe, that I actually worked on these gifts. Um, so this is really a gift or idea that you can use for any occasion. Definitely doesn't have to be just for Mother's Day. You can use it for a birthday or any other occasion, guys. If you were one of those that was fortunate enough to get these um, cute little flower arrangements from Dollar General, or if you had some similar, um, this is definitely a transformation that you can do. As you know, most of the time when you buy floral arrangements from stores, they are always a little bit skimpy and look like they need to have something added to them. So as I was telling you guys in previous videos, when it gets to be really, really crunch time, like the day before or a couple days before the holiday, you're not going to have as much time to put together baskets, even if you're like I am and you design really, really quickly, you still are not going to be able to keep up with the supply and demand. So I always result to doing more simpler things um, when I'm right there at crunch time and I need a whole lot of baskets done like really, really quick. Um, so although this was a little bit more involved like with putting the little tool and stuff in it, normally I just stick some flowers in it and call it a day. But this particular time, I did not want to use some of the flowers that I have that I will be using for a future product. I did project. I did not want to use those. So I was like, I have a whole, whole lot of tool. Let's use some of this tool to fill in the gaps with these flower arrangements and get these um, quick babies done. Okay. So that's what I did. And I just put tool in between the gaps and I actually glued the bath and body works right in the front of the arrangement guys so it was kind of like they was getting a two for one deal they were getting a flower arrangement at the same time a great bath and body work product oh y'all i am so sleepy sorry 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 for the yawning guys and i'm also washing clothes and my washing machine is keeping all kinds of noises i have my tablecloths in there washing and I really need a new washing machine. Hey, maybe that's something I will invest in with some of my money, honey, that I made. Um, but yeah, I was trying to wait till I move. But anyway, we're not we're not up here to talk about a washing machine. But I just hope that you all are able to hear me pass that loud washing machine. Um, so yeah, so I just um made these fuller by adding a tool in it. Like I said previously, I um hot glued the Bath and Body Works in, and all I did was stuck some of these penny balloons in, guys. And by the way, those balloons did go to a penny today. If you were able to look up on some of the stick balloons or the Mylar balloons, um, the day after any holiday at Dollar General, the balloons always go to a penny. So if it's Easter and they have Easter balloons, which I don't think I've ever seen Easter balloons in Dollar General, but whatever the holiday is, whether it's graduation, the next day, the graduation balloons are going to be a penny. If it's Mother's Day, the next day, Mother's Day balloons are going to be a penny. So keep that in mind for future holidays where you see the balloons. Okay, so yeah, I did pay. Oh gosh, I did pay $1 for some of them, but for a lot of them, I got them for a penny. I was not going out today looking for any because I was absolutely too tired, honey, to be looking for anybody penny balloons. But those balloons are very, very well worth it. Even if you're paying a dollar or you're buying them from the wholesale place, these balloons adds a great value value to either your baskets or your flower arrangements, whatever it is that you are doing. But I got the little arrangement together. Then I took some of those candles. Y'all know I found some for a penny. And I also purchased some for 90% off. I just slipped one of those candles inside of a treat bag. And then I used that same method with the tool. 
to make a little bow to tie around the candle guys i want y'all to know that these two items and one of the little small bears that i got for 90 percent off i probably paid about 20 or 30 cent for it i put all three of those items together in a bag and i sold those for 40 dollars so total investment let's see three dollars for the bath and body works um a penny or either a dollar for the balloons we'll just go ahead and say a dollar um so three four dollars in the arrangement i paid i think 60 or 80 cent so we're gonna say 480 oh gosh y'all please forgive me okay i know y'all like please go to bed will you um so like 480 the bag i got those in a bulk from um hobby lobby on clearance we're gonna say we spent maybe about five dollars on those bags um five to six dollars and i sold them for forty dollars so this is an idea you can use for any holiday guys when you are at the last minute and you just don't have time to be shrink wrapping no bags i mean no baskets you don't have time to be building no baskets you're just trying to get some quick quick money um and trying to get some more inventory on your table okay because let me tell you when you get down to four and five and six baskets honey people are not really going to be stopping because they're going to see that you really don't have anything and they're going to feel like they don't have anything to choose from so these are great, great items to add to your inventory table when you are out on the street selling, guys. So anyway, I don't remember how many of these baskets I made, but can I tell you that they flew off the table, literally? They flew off the table, guys. Um, and so, yeah, I was able to make them really, really quick. And I also was able to add more inventory to my table, which was a very great asset at the end. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. I'm going to stop talking, but yeah, this is pretty much it. But it was a great, great idea. But meanwhile, get your money, honey, and fill your bag to the next video. Bye, y'all.